I think we're, we're headed to uh, a radically different world. I think, a, a, I think a, a good world, an interesting world. Um, my prediction actually for humanoid robots is that ultimately there will be um, tens of billions. Um, I, I think everyone will want to have their personal robot. You can think of it like uh, as though you had your own personal C-3PO or R2-D2, or, but even better. Then who wouldn't want to have their own personal C-3PO or R2-D2? That would be pretty great. What if the future wasn't dystopian, but glorious? Elon Musk shares his radical vision of what's coming next, and it's unlike anything we've seen in human history. In this fascinating new conversation, Musk reveals a world powered by tens of billions of humanoid robots. He doesn't just see it as likely, he sees it as inevitable. Forget universal basic income. Musk predicts something even bigger, universal high income, a post-scarcity world where anyone can access any good or service they want. With robots transforming productivity and AI helping us unlock the mysteries of the universe, he says we're headed toward a civilization of astonishing abundance, if we get it right. From tunnel wormholes under Las Vegas to autonomous vehicles, from galaxy-spanning science fiction to solving traffic in your city, Musk lays out a future filled with awe, curiosity, and possibility. This isn't science fiction. It's what comes next. Um, and uh, I, I also think it, it unlocks an immense amount of economic potential because when you, you think about what is the output of an economy, it is productivity per capita at times population per capita. The, uh, once you have humanoid robots, the actual economic output potential is tremendous. Uh, it's, it's really unlimited. Um, potentially, we could have an economy 10 times the size of the current global economy where uh, no one wants for anything. Um, you know, sometimes in AI they talk about universal basic income. I think it's actually going to be universal high income, um, where anyone can have any goods or services that they want. Um, you know, a, a, a science fiction book recommendation that I have, which I think is probably the best envisioning of an AI future, is uh, the, the, the culture books by Ian Banks. Uh, very highly recommended um, for a uh, non-dystopian view of the future. Um, now, there, there obviously are some risks, you know, um, which illustrate perhaps the, if we don't do this right, you know, you can have like a James Cameron sort of movie, um, you know, Terminator. Um, we don't want that one. Um, but, uh, but having sort of a Star Trek future would be great, where we're out there exploring the stars, discovering the nature of the universe, um, and, um, and a level of prosperity and hopefully happiness that we uh, can't quite imagine yet. So I'm, I'm very excited about the future. Really, you can think of a car or future cars as being robots on four wheels. And, um, you know, I think uh, it would be very exciting to have autonomous vehicles here in the kingdom. But I should want to mention also uh, something that may be worth considering is tunnels. Tunnels. Uh, the Boring I, Company. I, I have this company called The Boring Company, uh, which sounds kind of boring, but it's, uh, it's, it literally bores tunnels. Um, and actually, uh, tunnels, in, in order to solve traffic, uh, you, you really need to go 3D uh, with roads. And by uh, using tunnels, you can essentially create, create like, like a wormhole, like a, like a wolf tunnel from one part of a city to another and alleviate traffic. And we're, we've actually already done this proof of concept in Vegas. So there are w working tunnels in, Ve in Las Vegas that you can use where um, that'll just, it feels like teleporting from one part of Vegas to another. So uh, I always say that, you know, my joke is like tunnels are underappreciated. You know? <laughs> um, you know, it's a bit of a, not, not always a hit, but um, yeah. And then XAI uh, is uh, just trying to solve uh, general purpose artificial intelligence. The goal with XAI is to have a maximally truth-seeking AI. Um, 
And it's, it's important to be maximally truth-seeking AI in order to understand the universe. So the, the goal of XAI is understand the universe. Um, to understand, uh, you know, you know what, what is out there? Um, where is the universe going? Where did it come from? What questions? In fact, I think maybe the biggest thing is what questions do we not know to ask? Like, I, once you know the question, the answer is usually the easy part. Um, so the goal of XAI is to help understand the universe and um, yeah, that's, that's the goal. And, and, and it help people answer any questions along the way, of course, but um, I mean, that's, that's my philosophy. My philosophy is of one of curiosity just trying to understand the nature of reality. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content.